it's not a planet that you're exploring. You're exploring a bunch of little bitty fish bowls generated based off of seeds that are shared in common with the planet. I'm going to go mountains just to demonstrate the point I'm trying to make here. Let's just say right here is the invisible wall. I see this mountain in the distance and I want to go explore it. I want to go get to the top of that mountain. Just like Todd Howard said back in the day about Skyrim, I see that mountain. I want to climb it. Well, the problem is that if the invisible wall is right here, because you can't actually just set your landing zone over here a little bit or over on this corner or whatever, because you can't do that, instead what you have to do is go to this menu and try to get as close to it as you possibly can. If I then travel to that landing zone, you will see there is no overlap. There are no overlapping mountain ranges or points of interest. It's completely different because every time you land that landing zone, is effectively a different seed that's generated. Both of these are different maps entirely.